Yes, sir. My question is: Is the MSP protection confined to surface E, <coughs> or does it provide protection for EPS, ESI, also? The, the MSMD Act provides for a contemplation mechanism, a framework for resolution of stress. The what is the purpose of the Act? Not to allow an MSME to die. Therefore, if any form of recovery is permitted. For instance, suppose a, a MSME had borrowed a purchase a machinery. I have a case in hand from Siemens. A machinery was purchased. Then there, the, then in, in legal terms, it may be given as a lease. It is a finance only, but the terminology employed is lease. There is an agreement for lease, and MSME in distress is unable to pay the rent. And tomorrow, they they seek to take possession of the property it happened as a case in the bombay high court against uh, siemens against one of my clients so there there's an arbitration agreement and the the, the siemens filed a petition under section 9 before the bombay high court act under arbitration act so the contention is the contention raised was that it is msme act is of no application because it is a lease and uh, it is not a credit facility so such a convention you see it's the, the if the enactment is a preventive legislation remedial legislation welfare legislation benevolent legislation and its whole purpose is to see that msme doesn't die out of sickness revive it bring him to back into life then the terminology has to be the has to be given the widest possible interpretation words employed the, uh, the act has to be understood in its widest possible meaning therefore my convention is every form of recovery if machinery is allowed to be taken away then for non payment of lease so it is not confined to the banks and financial institutions the mis the reason for the misconception is in paragraph 1 it says identification of incipient stress identification by banks or financial creditors Before a non-account of a micro, small, and medium enterprises turn into a non-performing asset, banks or creditors are required to identify incipient stress in the account by creating three subcategories under the special mention account, etc. So that is the reason for the misconception that the act is confined to the application of the notification is confined to bank and financial institutions. It is not. It is. the it, uh, uh, the scheme has to be the notification has to be given is widest possible meaning a purposive interpretation a benevolent interpretation that is uh, um, you know the, what the interpretation which will subserve the purpose of the act advance the advance the uh, the uh, the legislative intention <coughs> means legis the legislative intention that has to be adopted therefore and again there's a indication available in many other in the old notification it says that all all forms of creditors should be the committee is committed to give notice to the other creditors that many operational creditors and it says that this then the committee is also authorized to make a, a suitable provision for payment of tax uh, and other statutory dues what are statutory dues means employees burden fund efi epf then uh, esi the, then i would stress the scope of the notification even to recoveries and even prosecution under the negotiable instruments act payment of settlement scheme act all this so therefore this 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 doesn't this notification doesn't contemplate you know it, it creates a right for a resolution of stress nothing more nothing less the liability of a borrower is not taken away it is it continues remains it, it doesn't it doesn't get obliterated the rise of the banks and financial institution doesn't uh, obliterated it remains only this the scheme only contemplates that yes these provisions these recovery measures all forms of recovery whether under the for a lease rent or a, even a, even a electricity bill maybe uh, esi pf all all sorts of recovery coercive recovery proceedings has to be kept in abeyance so that the committee the, the could consider the feasibility of uh, a resolution of stress and implement it so the committee is to decide what kind of payment has to be given in priority 
and the what is contemplated in the scheme is a judicial tribunal the committee's decision are binding and uh, you know in the in the case of baf or even in the binding of proceedings also a decision is taken by a judicial tribunal sometimes without hearing the, the not every stakeholder is not heard so then parliament keeping the larger public interest has uh, as in the case of bfr as in the case of the companies act that even persons who are not before the committee even their rights could be uh, you know for the keeping the scheme work make to make the scheme work even their rights could be infringed or curtailed till so as to enable the scheme to um, uh, um, uh, work that is what that is interpretation i would like to give this issues have raised before the delhi high court in the madras high court in karnataka high court in different matters before the bombay high court and in the supreme court also now uh, this the, and uh, this not- notification came into existence in 2015 295 2015 and uh, uh, this practically it remain totally unimplemented uh, remain unimplemented the reason is the msmes are micro small media enterprise they don't have the they didn't get the right legal advice and even where they received a legal advice probably lawyers would have said see this scheme if to given effect would have a far reaching consequences so it may not be realistic to uh, insist and assert the not- rights conferred on this notification and the act but i think considering the the this when if parliament has ordained something what the the the, the 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 decision the ordain of ordain the ordain of the parliament the will of the parliament is will of the uh, people and the duty of the courts and and the statutory authorities like the reserve bank of india and the banks and financial institutions which work under the license granted by the reserve bank of india is to uh, to give effect to that so therefore the certainly the notification and the benefit under the act are is a right of the msmes and they must strive for it and they will succeed